Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Andrea and yes, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for today's video, we are going to review the Canon G7X Mark II. I just purchased this camera and to tell you, I really love the camera but there are also some bad sides. There are good sides and also bad sides. So if you are a vlogger and considering to purchase this kind of camera, this video is for you. First things first, we are going to review about the image quality, the audio, the low light, focus, and of course, the stabilization. First of all, I just would like to clarify that I am not a professional one in interviewing this kind of technology, but I am basing on my experience and I am really basing on my own experience. Now that I cleared the air, it is now time for our review. Hi everyone, so this is actually for the test of the image quality of our review at the moment and this is the Canon G7X Mark II and this is the Samsung J4 Plus. So I am um, used my other phone so that uh, we have a comparison. So as you can see, I really do like the image quality of the Canon G7X Mark II here compared to the Samsung J4 Plus and this is our test for our image quality. Now for our audio, I don't know if you can hear me clearly, so I am using the audio of the Canon G7X Mark II. At the same time, here is the audio of Samsung J4 Plus. But at the moment, throughout this whole video, I am using the audio of Canon G7X Mark II. And so far, I have no problems. In all of my videos using the Canon G7X Mark II, I'm just using the audio of the camera, not really switching or doing another, like using my microphone, which is the BM800. So this is actually the test of our low light. So I am here upstairs and I'm going downstairs because the downstairs are very, very dark. So if I'm good light, very, very bright light, you downstairs oh wow so as you can see here it is actually the indoor lighting pero kung makikita niyo dito sa Samsung J4 Plus natin sobrang dilim you can look to the Canon G7X Mark II ang ganda ng low light niya compared to the Samsung. And this is actually the darkest part of our house. This is actually here in the kitchen. Like you can see the Samsung J4 Plus, I don't see it. I don't see it on my own. Unlike here in the Canon G7X Mark II, I can see it on my own. It's back again. So if you really do want to purchase the Canon G7X Mark II at sa madilim na parte, kahit na sa madilim ka na bahay, nakikita mo ang sarili mo. And that's a good sign. One of the best features of the Canon G7X Mark II is the autofocus. So I am just going to tap the Del Monte. As you can see, it is already focused on Del Monte. I'm going to tap again to the Green Cross. As you see, out of focus on the green cross so this is actually the focus test of our camera now I receive a lot of comments about the focus that there is such a problem in the autofocus and so far as I have experienced this camera I don't really see any problem with the autofocus I also tried testing the zoom in and zoom out and as you can see, that is really a good sign where I can zoom everything and I can still see everything. So that is one of the good sides of the Canon G7X Mark II. So this is actually the test for the stabilization. And what am I going to do is similar location to our low light test. 
so we are going to use the stairs so I'm gonna do up and down and up and down and see if we can still do really see going down going up I don't know are, are you feel shaky are you feel shaky I think it's shaky. going down again and going up this is actually a good exercise <laughs> Do you feel shaky? Or do you feel shaky? <laughs> and what am I gonna do? I am gonna do <laughs> energy stabilization. One of the things that I am very very down with using my phone camera is that when I walk it actually like you know makes me dizzy when I watch the film so so far so good the Canon G7X Mark II is really great and as you can see that's very tiring so that is all the tests that we have and I can really say na ang ganda talaga ng Canon G7X Mark II but as I have said there is a good side and there's also a bad side and one of the bad sides of the Canon G7X Mark II dahil sobrang ganda ng image quality niya nahihirapan akong mag-edit sa laptop ko that's one of the reasons and that is one of the downsides of having a great camera yung mahihirapan kang mag-edit but I think that if you have a great software editing software malalampasan mo yun at maganda ang results and the second one, one of the bad sides of the Canon G7X Mark II is the battery. Sobrang dali niyang malubat to the point na konti pa lang yung mga nag-video mo o nare-record mo, madali na siyang malubat. So, that's one of the bad sides. At hindi ko siya ma-recommend for vlogs, especially on the daily vlog, yung mag-vlog ka talaga ng buong araw. Uh, I do recommend it, but you have to, like, have an extra battery for you to survive the whole day of vlogging. <laughs> and lastly, one of the bad sides of having the Canon G7X Mark II is the flip screen. Now, I know that everyone is going to comment down below na ang ganda ganda ng flip screen. Yes, maganda ang flip screen. But I also find it very distracting to the point na sa lahat ng videos ko when I'm starting to use the Canon G7X Mark II, parati akong nakatingin sa flip screen. Katulad dito. Kasi nga, I am comfortable at looking at myself, pero hindi ko natitrain yung sarili ko to look at the lens kung saan nakikipag-usap ako sa inyo. Kaya, yung buong video ko, like the whole video will be like me looking at the flip screen while talking to you guys. So, that's one of the disadvantage of the flip screen. Though, it has a good side, but again, it also has a bad side. So, if you're a vlogger and you're looking for a camera, the Canon G7X Mark II is really for you. There are three reasons why. Maganda, compact friendly, and of course, lightweight. If you're a vlogger and you're using your cell phone, there is no problem at all. Lahat tayo nagsimula dito. And I don't see any problem for you to stop vlogging just because you don't have a camera. And that is all the video for today. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and also click the notification bell for more videos from me.